calmness greets you as the submersible slows to a halt. Unlike the Iron Throne, you remain intact. So, it seems, will the families of all the hostages rescued from the throne. Duke Ravenguard approaches you, looking confused. He's tangled, but under my protection now, just like you. His mind is his own again. I'm free, in my own mind again, holy. I will not take it for granted. You acted quickly, decisively, and compassionately. I, nay, all of us owe you no less than our undying gratitude. The, the absolute. Its voice was clear as crystal. Beautiful as a nip smile. It showed me the darkest lies and convinced me of their truth. To be free is like knowing the sun's warmth on my face for the first time. My thoughts are my own now. And my purpose certain. I will wait at your camp. We can speak more there. We actually All right, it. we're good to go. Say goodbye to camp and come up the hatch when you're ready. Indolence breeds madness. I'll save you! I just... I... I can't thank you enough. I was certain that place was to be my cold, wet tomb. You... you saved us. Saved us all. I thought it impossible, but... but you did it. We were kept hostage to control our families in the Steel Watch Foundry, to keep them building Gortash's death machines. Please. They need to know what happened here. They have no reason to obey Gortash anymore. If they rebel, it'll put a dent in Gortash's steel might. He... he did? Of course he did! I knew it. I knew he would do something. Your world's heir. I never imagined missing its feeling on my skin. Curious. I owe you a great debt, child of the stars. One I shall repay. When I return to the surface, I will alert my colleagues at the Society. Find me there, and I will offer you what aid I can against this evil. 